Lighter particles, such as sand, are suspended in the water. Larger grains and pebbles are pushed along the bottom. The faster the river flows, the more it can carry. In this way, fragments of rock are transported towards the sea. This demonstration illustrates what happens when they get there. The sand and pebbles in the guttering are behaving as if they were in a river. The tank at the end is the sea. Where they meet, the flow of water slows down. It no longer has the energy to carry its load and the particles fall to the sea floor forming sediments which gradually build up over time. Over the years, these sediments get squashed and compressed and harden to form our second type of rock. Two clues for spotting sedimentary rock are grains and layers. This one is called sandstone. All sedimentary rocks are formed under the sea but they aren't all made of sand. Limestone is made from the shells and bones of sea creatures and corals. As they die and fall to the seabed, they build up over time to form new rock.